Okay. Boozer, you there? I was just calling to check up on you. Yeah, Dee, come here. You hang in there, buddy. As soon as we get that arm patched up, we're riding north, just like you said. Nah, I hope so. God, I miss you. Just work on getting better. I still got some work to do on the bike, and we gotta stock up on some gear. But once you're patched up, we're out of here, peeking out. Here's the generator. Jenny's out of gas. Jenny's always out of gas. Yeah, now we're in business. Power's off, figures. Okay. Oh, God damn it. Fuse blown. Oh, where the hell am I gonna get a fuse?
Bring them all down on me. is it going to take before all of this is finally gone? Nice refugee camp. Yeah, we all would have been better off out in the shit. Nero couldn't protect you from a goddamn thing.
Okay. Too bad. Let's go.
I know more for you. Get the hell out of my camp. How many of you sons of bitches are there? Huh? <laughs> How many? <laughs> More bounties. I'm going to tell you something. I, it's okay. It's just weird. You told me that we shouldn't come back, and I didn't listen to you. I mean, I knew that it was getting worse, but I... None of us knew it was going to go away like this. It's fast. You don't understand. I don't know what I would do if I lost you. This is my fault. Hey. I'm not losing anyone. I made a promise. Remember? Deacon, wait! Sarah, come on. There's a kid here. <laughs> hey. Hey, are you okay? Come on, we gotta find your parents, okay? Hey, come on. Um, I don't know, I don't I don't think it's that bad. Okay. Just hold this here as long as you can. I don't think so. I think I can walk. Okay, good enough. Almost there. <laughs> Two hours ago, this place was calling the feds. Yeah, they must have evacuated. Yeah, 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 they must have bugged the hell out. Yeah, she's burning out. The uh, knife must have nicked her kidney or something. She's turning septic. Mm. How you doing, mm. little sister? So stupid. It was this little, this little kid. This, this goddamn little kid. The goddamn knife. Hey, help me. Mm. <laughs> Mm. Oh, shit. Mm. Hey, Mom. You want to be able to come through? We gotta get to the roof. Flag down one of those choppers. Mm. Mm. Yeah, see if we can rest over here. Hey. Mm. Easy, easy. <sighs> she reminded me so much of my little sister, you know? Mm. She used to play that hide and seek game all the time. And she would just, just uh, hide her head in her coat just like that. Um. I've been cutting my name, but nothing like that. She's burning up. Jesus. Look at her. 
We gotta move. We ain't going that way. Ah, come on. Thanks, we are. Can you move? Oh, sir. Yeah, I got it. We'll go find this way out. Listen to me. My girl's out there. She's been stabbed. We're just trying to get to the roof. Get out there's here. a helicopter. You killed her. So listen. You killed just... my wife. Oh no no no! I, I didn't know anything about no. your wife being killed. I'm sorry, sir. No, sir. Okay. Do it now. Do it. 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 Do She's not whatever the hell's going on out there. She's been stabbed. I can't take anymore. Oh, okay, listen up, Brian. If we don't get her to a hospital, she's going to die. There are no more hospitals. <laughs> oh, come on, no more hospitals. You got uh, doctors, you got triage, you got a mass unit. Oh, look, I'm just a grad student, okay? I, I got volunteered for this. I'm not even supposed to be out here, okay? Brian. Okay. I've only got room for two of you, okay? Two. Why do you got room for two of you? We're overweight, okay? I can only take two of you, two. <laughs> come on, help me, come on. All right, sweetheart. That's okay. You're gonna be all right. I got her. Let's go. We gotta get on that guy. We gotta get on that I heard what he said. There's only room for two on that chopper. Go. Go with her. I'll be okay. Look, I've been to worse shit than this before. You know? Here we go. Where are you going? What? Where? Where? Refugee camp, west of Three Finger Jack. No. Boozer is never going to make it without me. Chopper. Wonder what the hell they're up to.
Radio Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. Today, I was thinking about where it all began. The roots go deep. Back to the big WW2. 1947, the feds passed a, what they call it, the National Security Act. Now, what this did was give the feds the right to take over our roads, railroads, and radio. Anything they damn well pleased. Without a warrant. Today, the feds are gone. But we're still here. Shining the spotlight of truth on the world. Truth is, I seen it coming. Years ago, we had photos. Nero death camps built to hold us, American citizens. No one believed me. If more of us had spoken up, none of this would have happened. I'll tell you one thing. It won't happen again. This is Mark Copeland for Radio Free Oregon. Don't believe the lies. Well, you were right about one thing, Cope. All these Nero refugee camps, they did turn out to be death camps, just not the way you were expecting. Got your radio on? I crafted you a couple of items. Boozer, you got that bounty. The only reason that I go up.
hold on, hold on, they're slowing down. Looks like they're stopping. trying to hit me, I would be dead. Deke, remember me telling you about that death wish of yours? Yeah, 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 I got this. Stick it out. Is a radio all right? God damn it, get back here with that little shit that's mine! Ah, oh, finally, Jesus Christ, those shits can run fast. Yes. So, what the hell are they doing? Looked like they were out here. Shit, wrangling freaks, I don't know. They had a newt in some kind of noose, like they were putting a tracking device on it or something. What? Wrangling? What, what do you mean? You know, like tying it up, taking samples from it or something, like those guys used to do on that wildlife show. Pretty fucked up. They got chased off by swarmers, bugged the hell out. They left some gear behind, a radio. Wait, you don't, you don't think that Sarah... No, no, not, I, I, I don't know, I'm just... And he's alive, Boozer, he's alive. O'Brien, one of them, Nero. I'm gonna...
track him down. If I can, I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get some answers. Damn it. Okay. Look, I'll be able to ride soon. I'll help you, Deke. If he's alive, we'll find the bastard. You're goddamn right. I'm gonna check in later. Deacon out. Okay, O'Brien. Where the hell are you? So I'm sort of lost. I was hoping you could help me out. I'm sorry, you're lost? Yeah, yeah. I'm looking for the old Belknap Road, and there's not a lot of signs around here. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. Nope. What? What is it? What? Oh. It's <laughs> great. That is just perfect. <laughs> that is great. That is great. So about those directions? <laughs> I'm really sorry. I, I don't know where Belknap, Belknap, Belknee, Belknap. Belknap? Belknap, that's the one. And I don't know where it is. I really can't help you. I'm sorry. So no, then? <sighs> nope. Okay. Well, thanks anyway. Hey! <sighs> All right. <laughs> Could you use a ride? Yes, I could. Thank you for finally offering. I'm Sarah. I'm Deacon. Oh, well, sorry about the mess. <clears throat> um, I don't know. How do I, uh, this contraption? Pretty much what you think. You just throw your just... leg over. Yeah. Okay. Um, there. Whoa. Okay. <clears throat> Ready. Hey! <laughs> hey! Hold on tight. Thank you so much. No problem. It's just, there are no bars out here, so... Well, sure there is. There's a place called Crazy Willie's up the road. There's, uh... No, I meant cell phone reception. I know what you meant. Right, of course. Anyway. So what's a nice girl like you doing in a place like this? <laughs> you know, I ask myself that all the time. I do research. Um, you know, I study things. Thanks. Had no idea what research was. Sorry, um, I do plants. You study plants? Yeah. You sure you're okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I just... Oh, my God. Hey. Hey. I've got cell phone reception. Hey. Yeah, I'm fine. I just... The car you gave me, it's a real piece of shit. I need a tow. I'm on, um... I don't know, some... I don't know where Road I am. Road 42. Road 42? Yeah, I'm, I'm about a mile up. Okay, I'll see you when you get here. Come on, I'll take you back to your car. We can wait for the tow truck. <laughs> I don't know. Well, all right. I'm sure when those boys come back, I'd be happy to give you a ride, so... <laughs> okay, all right. 
<clears throat> All right, I just, just give me a second. It'll be any minute now. All right, so. all right, all right, screw it, let's go. Just drive a little careful this time, okay? <laughs> You weren't really lost, were you? Well, that all depends on who you ask. My ex would say I've been lost for years. Well, you certainly know your way around here. You're not from around here. No, I'm from Seattle. The company that I work for, they just, they opened this lab here, so... Here I came to the middle of nowhere. To research plants. That's right, I already told you I forgot. Um, yeah, so the company that I work for, they, they do work for bioengineering firm and uh, some of the plants that I, I look at are pretty rare and they just happen to grow here. That has got to be the best thing I've ever heard. Oh, what the hell? Clay, we got company. <sighs> All right, gentlemen. Hit him again. How you like that bike, boy? Way to do it. Come on, hit him. Not so tough now. Him. <laughs> uh, you don't learn, do you, you bike boy? Day. Oh, yes. Yes. Oh, I'll teach him good. Yeah, you like that? How about that? Shit. Yeah, I'm out. Hold on, hold on. Roll, goddammit. Roll. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my God. No, no, no. Uh, oh, my God. Hey. I'm so sorry. No, I, no, no. I don't even know. I just was looking in your bag, and no, it's I, I right. saw that, and I... Oh. oh, my God, I could have killed somebody. Well... Oh, shit. Yeah, but you, you gotta kind of aim it at them first. See, I've never done anything like that before. Hey, I saw, it's okay, it's okay. I They're saw gone. it in They're your gone. bag, and I just I tried to call you the police, good. but there were no You know what we're gonna no do? Bars. We're gonna, gonna do? no reception. I'm gonna wait right here. Until your guy comes. Okay. Thank you. I've never done anything like that. Huh. Could have fooled me. Yeah? Tucker, Hot Springs Camp, you there? I'm gonna need more info on that survivor Larson spotted in Marion Forks. Deacon, I already told you everything I know. Young, a woman. Wait, he mentioned Hungry Tim's. That old pancake house by the East Bridge. Lumberjack, big stack of pancakes. Yeah, I know the one. Okay, I'll start there. You do that. And remember, bring her to me. A group of drifters came through the other day, traded us a few guns. Maybe something you could use. I'll keep that in mind. You can out.
Deke, how's it? Going. I got bored. Figured I'd see if I remembered how to make anything. Stop by when you can. I think you'll like it. Boozer, thank you. Yeah, I'll stop by later. Marauder camp. These are the assholes who've been ambushing the roads around here. everything. Drop your 
Let's do this, come on. You murdering savage. I gotta kill them all. Every last one of these murdering sons and bitches.
somewhere. I would need water. Maybe, maybe down by the creek. Gotta look around. <laughs> Gotta be hers. This must be where she comes to get water. Yeah, you come here for water every day, don't you? As you move cautiously, you know, stick around more. Good for you. Street. I only come out at night and freakers are out, but she'd be harder to see. Getting out of here alive. Hell yeah. Sorry, goddammit. Spread out, look around. There's a girl here somewhere.
This more than you. Be needing this.
was sealed up. How she get in and out? This is it. Come on. Just gotta set it here. All right, kid, where are you hiding? Don't be afraid. Uh, I'm not gonna hurt you. Are you alone? Is there uh, anyone else with you? Oh man. Okay. Uh, is is this your room? It's really great. Uh, are are these yours? No. Uh, <laughs> That's oh. mine. This one's for gymnastics. I should have won first place, but Missy King, she cheated. Lisa! Lisa, you hear the gunshots outside? It's not safe here. I was now, at if we... school. And my mom called me and told me to come home right away and not stop, and they would be here waiting for me, and we would leave together, and... Got here and there was a note that said they left with some men and I didn't know what to do. So so I hid. I, I, I didn't know what to do. It's alright, it's okay. It's okay. Uh Lisa, not far from here, there's a camp. And you really ought to let me take you there. No. Uh, there are people there. There are people, I know them. It's, I'm not gonna lie to you, it's a work camp, and to eat, you have to work. Life is gonna be hard, no. but at least you ain't gonna starve. No, uh, no my mom's coming here is, for okay, me. Okay, is this your mommy? Well, you said she didn't come home, right? So, maybe she's at the camp. Mom is at the camp. I know she is. Okay. Stay close. The men with the guns. Are they still out there? No, we don't gotta worry about them. Did you kill them? They're gone. Lots of sick people. Oh, 
shouldn't be out here. Oh! <laughs> 
Have you ridden before? No. Just climb on behind me. Hang on tight. What's your name? Uh, Deacon. My name's Deacon. Uh, Lisa, Lisa, how did you live out here alone for all this time? <sighs> you don't talk much, do you? My dad's a rock hound. He used to take me out here looking for thunder eggs. Thunder eggs? Uh, what is that? They're rocks, but when you cut them open, they're really pretty inside. Okay, that, that sounds great. We used to go all over. On that crater, the lava flow and black crater, everywhere. Do you think he's at the camp too? Uh, I don't know, kid. Someone's in the tunnel. What? Here, listen to me. The gunshots that you heard, those were really bad men. Do you understand? Yes. Stay here, find some place to hide. Don't come out until Man's I say coming. Oh. Yeah, run at him! We got him! Yeah. Kill him! Take him down! Get down! Get down! Bring him down! Come on out! Got him! Hop on. Are you okay? Yeah. I, I think I want to go home. Nah, kid, the camp. You'll be safe there, you'll see. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna ask you a question, Lisa, and I need you to think real hard. Did any of your neighbors, did they own any firearms, you know, like uh, pistols, rifles, things like that? No. Men came and took everything. Men? Were they like the men in the tunnel, or, or did they wear uniforms like, uh, like in the army? Like the army. But they were really dirty, and they carried flags they made themselves. Um, Deschutes County Militia, I think. I don't remember. Did they have anyone with them? Women? Children? I don't remember. Okay. Tommy would remember. Tommy? Tommy Strickland. My best friend. But he's gone. He left with his dad to hide. Hide? I, I don't... His dad built a fallout shelter and put all kinds of stuff in it. Maps, food, water, guns, you know, stuff like that. Okay, okay, do you know where that is? No. They wanted me to come with them, but I knew my mom and dad would come back for me. Hey, someone's here. All right, this is it. We're here, so just gate. stay with me. Okay.
Well, who do we have here? Mrs. Tucker. Oh, my God. Oh. Lisa, honey. Oh. It's okay. You're safe now. Mom and Dad, and everyone got sick, and I didn't know what to do, and men came, and people got sh sick, and... It's okay. You're safe now. It's a miracle. It's a goddamn miracle. We were neighbors, weren't we, Lisa? I lived just down the block. I knew her parents. Are they here, Mrs. Tucker? Honey, you know the answer to that. No. They're not here. Let's go in. Get you cleaned up. Something to eat, and then, then I'll find a place for you to sleep. Take her in. Give her some food. Go see Alkai. I'll update your credits tonight. Hey, hey, listen, listen. She's she's been through a lot. Can we just let me worry about how? No, listen to me, okay? Seriously, don't work her like you do everyone else. Don't tell me how to run my camp. You want to move here? You want to help us run this? Then maybe you get some say. <laughs> don't get soft on me, Dee. list or no? Deke, you have a ride with a drifter, scars all over his face, carries a tire iron, goes by the name of Limbo? Don't know him. He came into camp yesterday to turn in some bounties, have a few drinks. Seems like he didn't leave until early this morning. Well, Tuck, I don't run security here, so why don't you just tell Alki about that? He beat a man, Deke, and a woman, to death. Bowman and Hewitt. Her face was so smashed in, you couldn't tell it was her. Hewitt, hey, back to work. Maria, right? Oh, Jesus. This asshole, Limbo, he's a local. Alki says they've set up shop at the old Forest Service watchtower on the east slope of Three Finger Jack. Yeah, I know where it is, and, uh, I'll handle it. I thought you might. Hey, what do you need? Uh, just having a look. Fill her up. Ah, I rode this one hard. Okay, then. It's your bike, right? See ya. Hey, uh, how's it going? I haven't seen Boozer around much lately. Yeah, he's around. I guess he's just been doing more work for Copeland lately. <laughs> you tell him. Mm hmm. Right. Later, man. How you doing? You need something? Hey, what's up? Powerful. Good shot. You'll like this one. Why aren't you working? Hey, back to work. Hey, no, 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 don't. Uh, I'm getting to work. Good piece. Should help out in the shit. Can I get anything else for you?
come by if you still need something. Oof. I'll let Tucker know you stopped by. I'm just gonna grab some shot eye. 